Welcome to Too Fun Books. My name is Janelle and it's time for another in the series of If You Liked for March Mystery Madness. Before I get to that though, I need to show you the book that I found that was a thriller in the third person. And I am going with The Missing American by Quay Corti. Um, this was again on my TBR cart. I'm excited to get to this this month. This is um, the first Emma Gian investigation. It is set in Ghana. She is a private investigator. Um, and I would definitely, it looks to me like these would be classified more as thrillers than whodunits. And so that's why I'm going with this one. Okay, for today's episode of If You Liked, we are going to talk about the Brighton series by Ellie Griffiths. If you liked this series, I have two suggestions for you. First of all, the more popular Ellie Griffith series is the Ruth, the Dr. Ruth Galloway one, but I want to talk about her Brighton series. This is a series that she has set in Brighton in the 1950s. And the main characters are these guys that were um, in a special unit during the war. And it was all about um, deception and um, uh, kind of making things difficult for the, for the enemy. And these guys had a history um, or experience in magic, um, especially one of them. Um, he was a magician and so they were able they're able to use that their skills that way with sleight of hand and all of that stuff um, when they were in the army during World War II and so this series now is in in 1950 in Brighton and uh, it's a really really fun series so if you if you've never if you've never read it I, I recommend that you check it out but if you did like that series, then I can recommend for you the Flavia Deleuze series by Alan Bradley. Now, I'm never sure if I'm saying that name right. It could be Flavia. I apologize. I don't really know. This is a series set in 1950s England. Flavia, Flavia is 11 years old and interested in chemistry. This is a really fun series. Um, it has like a similar tone, which is why I'm recommending it. Also, just because it's set in the 50s. Um, I think that uh, that's just really fun in England. Um, and I read, I, I haven't read that whole series yet, but the ones that I have read, I've really enjoyed. The other recommendation I have for you, if you like the Brighton series by Ellie Griffiths, is the Constable Twitten series by Lynn Truss. This is a series that is also set in Brighton in the 50s. It's the later 50s, 1957. Constable Twitten is a brand new constable on the force. Um, the Constable Twitten series is, is witty and quirky, um, but slightly more, um, it's not like gritty or whatever, but there is violent, a little, a little bit of violence and stuff like that, because there's, there's a lot about like the criminal underworld in, in that series, but I really like it. I love the way that Lynn Trust writes and, um, the, the characters are so intriguing and I really like the stories. So today's, if you liked, are basically all about books set in England in the 1950s. <laughs> So if you have a recommendation for me about a mystery set in England in the 50s, um, I would love it if you could share that in the comment section down below. So for today's, if you liked the Ellie Griffiths Brighton series, I can recommend the Flavia Deleuze series by Alan Bradley and the Constable Twitten series by Lynn Truss. And um, before I say goodbye, it's time for the next round in the 2x2 mystery game. Here we go. It's time for another round of our two by two game. Three gives us setting. Will it be rural or urban? Roll number two. Two. All right, so the gender of the detective is either going to be male or female. All right, roll number three. Four. So we need to find a book with a rural setting 
and a male detective. Good luck to you. Um, please put the book that you find in the comment section down below and I will see you for another video soon. Bye.